Alongside Ray Ferraro, who's down at ice level, I'm James Cebalski, ready to bring you what should be a very entertaining contest. Opening face-off is set to go. Referee Shil Levesque is ready to drop the puck. The Islanders take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Moves it to Bjorkstrand. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still no score in this one. Barzell's one possession. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Puck picked up by Pullock. Right in front! Oh, big time use of physicality on that one. And that's turned aside by Corpusalo. Cutting to the front of the net. The Islanders take it along the wall. Hammers a shot just wide. Now, tough to generate a rebound even when the puck misses the net by that much. Scooped up along the wall by Bjorkstrand. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Puck scooped up by Bjorkstrand. And they fail to go tape to tape. Couldn't complete the play. Tempers flaring here. Yeah, but it's got the goalie involved too, which is the rarest of opportunities here. New York's won the faceoff deep in their own end. The Islanders take it along the wall. Good hit on the play. Nelson's taking the puck behind the net, and it's kicked away. Right on the doorstep. Wow. Scores! Yes! Yes! Yes, they're on their feet here tonight. New York's weathered the storm here, and they've taken a 1-0 lead. Always better to play from in front, and they'll want to expand this lead as quickly as they can. The Islanders are in transition. The Blue Jackets gain control of the puck against the wall. Directed over to Savard. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Rocks him. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Taken by Beauvillier. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The Islanders lead it 1-0. Koivu's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Pumps the puck away. And now he angles it across to Felino. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Grabs control of it at the point. Can't find his man. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Angles it over to Polino. Look out, a two-on-one. He scores! They tie it up! Oh, they've been working hard to get this game back to level, and that goal will do it. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Blue Jackets win the draw here in the neutral zone. Smart defensive play there. And we've got a two-on-one. Pucks it away in his own end. Columbus gains a hold of possession. And he loses possession to the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Here's a chance to set up now. The Islanders will take it behind the net, and he loses control of the puck. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Well past the midway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Centering pass! Oh, just wide of the net! It doesn't matter how close it is. If it's not on the net, it can't go in. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. Sin bin bound for tripping. I always hated taking tripping penalties. It always felt like there was something I could have done better than that. Slides the puck to Nelson. And he's going after him here. 
Jones is roaming around looking for somebody else to fight. He just can't find it. He was locked in there. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Moves it quickly over to Bailey. And that's picked off. Columbus takes the puck through the neutral zone. New York's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Stones him in front. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. Here's a shot. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Varlamov. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. The Blue Jackets gain possession along the wall. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed on that one. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job, keeps this game tied. Hickey's got the puck through the neutral zone. Manages to hang on. The Blue Jackets take possession in the defensive end. Pokes the puck away. The Islanders get a hold of it. Puck grabbed by Peugeot. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. Barzell's won the draw. And the linesman calls icing on the play. The setters will glide into the dot. The Blue Jackets win the faceoff. Win the draw after the icing. You possess the puck while they're running around a little bit tired. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Columbus has it in the offensive end. Strong defensive effort. New York's got the puck along the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And now it's grabbed by Domi. Inside the final minute of the first here. Quick feed to Nash. Picks it off. Look out. And with the sound of the horn, that brings some finality to the opening period, and we've got a close one. Period two is set to go. Been a fun one so far. Neither side giving an inch. Still tied here as we open things up in the second. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? The Islanders have been grinding away, trying to find a way into the offensive zone and generate some shots. They don't have very many. Probably pretty lucky the game's tied. The Blue Jackets get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Columbus has it against the half wall. Drills them. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Good defensive effort to poke it away. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Play whistled dead because of an offside. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We got a tie game. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Knife has got the puck. Passes on over to Pajo. Columbus gains control of the puck. Quick pass to Nightfist. That's not going to fool him. Takes the feed from the goaltender. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. The centermen glide into position. Koivu's won the draw. Blocked in front. Takes the puck along the boards. New York's got control of it now from their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Bailey. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Gavrikov's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Bailey's been nabbed for tripping. Fishing around for the puck, he gets his stick into the player's feet. And this becomes an easy call. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
Taken along the wall by Felino. Makes the save. Cool and calm under pressure. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Columbus wins the draw here in the offensive zone. Couldn't find the intended target. Here's a short pass to Hickey. That pass goes a little sideways. And he takes a shot with the stop. Slides it diagonally to Atkinson. There's another stop. Oh, he'll feel that one. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. And the officials are calling a delayed penalty here. Looks like a trip. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Taken by Pulak. Set it out in front. Big time stop. Corpusello's right on top of that chance. Great A spot. Great A save. They've got numbers to his teammate. He scores! Well, they break the tie here, James. This game had been hotly contested since it's been level. They now have found a way to jump into the lead. Columbus makes the most out of not a lot on the ice tonight. Now that first period was tight. Not a lot of room around, but now you're in the second period and they've got the lead. The Islanders played along the boards. Here he is in front. He scores. They tied it up. Brand new game. All that work that's gone behind this. And we're back to even Steven. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Offside is the call. And we'll have a face off just outside the offensive zone. That puck's got to be moved a little quicker there, James, as they're moving up to the blue line. Get it out of your hand so nobody goes offside. Dubois won it. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Move to the middle. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Levels him with the hit. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And he totally whiffs on that one. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Puck picked up by Pichon. Sends the pass over. Trying to get back on the attack now. The Islanders have it against the wall. Huge steal in his own end. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the pocket. He gets his stick caught in their feet. Domi's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. The Islanders look to start the transition game. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now with a man advantage. It's in! He scores! Bang, bang. Two goals and right around a minute 40. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. New York's got it across the line. The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Receives the pass. And he comes up with it. Moves it to Letty. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. Gains the zone through the middle. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. With possession along the wall. Here's the pass. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Varlamov. Big save by the goaltender once again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. More than half the period has expired. The Islanders are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. His reflexes on display tonight. The Blue Jackets' man advantage comes to an end and not the result they were looking for, giving up a shorty. Well, now they got a bigger hole to dig out of. They give up the shorthanded goal. A sloppy power play, and they pay for it. Puts it up front. Snapper from the slot. Dismiss that chance. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. And sends it just out of reach. Here comes oh. the pushback. Grigorenko's He scores! One times it into the back of the net. The Islanders have to be feeling good about themselves here late in the second period with now a two-goal lead. Right into the second half of the game. They'd love to be able to...
able to duplicate that first half, which was almost perfection. What a steal in his own end. The Islanders will play it in their own end. It's a two-on-one. Here he is, wrestling on net. Too much traffic in the lane. Puck scooped up by Koivu. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. New York's got possession here in the neutral zone. Picks off the pass. On the doorstep, and they can't convert to the play. Denied that one. Puck grabbed by Bailey. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Picked up along the boards by Bailey. Pushes it across to Jenner. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. The Blue Jackets take possession here in the open ice. And that one's broken up. Takes the feed. Sends a pass over. Dropped him in the open ice. Breakaway. Oh, what a stop on the breakaway. Good speed to break ahead of the pack. He thinks he's got the goalie beat, but shot down. That's a great stop. Comes up with the stop. And that's broken up. Well, not exactly a banner night for the goaltenders as the second period comes to an end. At least they'll get a breather here. The Islanders are going to have to figure out how to roll their bench down a player. They just got news, as I did, that that player will not return. Well, that certainly changes things going forward. Thanks for the update, Ray. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Moves it quickly over to... He scores! What a run of play this has been. Four straight goals for them. They have not taken their foot off the gas at all. Lots of time left in this period. New York's really put the squeeze on here now, up by three. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Domi's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Nyquist. Broken up at center. Nice poke check. And he regains control of the puck. Move to the middle. Knocked away. Right up front. Great save by Corpusalo. Takes the pass. Look out. A two-on-one. Comes up with a big-time glove save. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Can't catch up to the pass. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Fails to find the open man. And a big stick save by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged a good save. Columbus must be a little frustrated offensively. They've had plenty of good looks, but they still trail early in this third period. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Pichon. The Blue Jackets have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Here they are on the attack. Can't connect. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Maintains possession. Misses. Now he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. No one home on that play. Quick feed to Bjorkstrand. The Blue Jackets played along the wing. Grabbed along the board by Felino. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a chance. Sends it over. Wide of the net. Picked up along the wall by Mayfield. Can't connect. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. And that one's turned away. Corpusalo's fought that puck all night long. He makes a good save there, James, but it's been a long night for him, and the guys in front of him haven't been much better. Strong defensive effort. Scooped up along the wall by Jenner. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Steps into all of that. There's the whistle penalty coming up. So often in a, in a shifty little play, the, you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick and there's nothing you can do. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Nice pass. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Excellent stick work on the play. Steps in front of the shot. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. 
Rocks him on the play. Handles the puck. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Quick pass across to Beauvillier. Couldn't complete the play. Down Coles on the attack in the offensive zone. He got all of that one. Strong use of the body. The Blue Jackets gain possession along the wall. Jabs the puck away. Right up front. Whoa. He scores. That's a short-handed marker. James, they took advantage of one little crease, and they were able to race up the ice, get themselves a short-handed marker here. Past the midway mark in this period, the Blue Jackets are down a pair. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. New York's coaches will not be liking that power play opportunity as they fail to convert and give up a shorthanded one. And I certainly didn't like much about that power play. The shorthanded goal, of course, is the exclamation point. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Looking to set up offensively. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. And that pass goes awry. Moves it over to Lee. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Barlamov's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. Here in the late going of the frame, the Islanders holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. Hammers it on net. They score! All you want to do is give yourself a chance. They were able to cut this lead to one. Now can they find another? Columbus might be setting us up for a pretty fun finish down the stretch here, Ray. Uh, once the pressure gets on, everything becomes unpredictable. Only trailing by one. They can't take their foot off the gas. Lines, Let's it go with the stop. The Blue Jackets move the puck in the defensive zone. Columbus is on the attack. The Blue Jackets grab possession to the puck. Right out in front. Scores! Really good effort here to continue to push along, try and find a way to crack the defense. They've done it, and this game is tied. Absolutely clutch! Taken by Kukin. Handles the puck from the left side. Centering pass! And they can't connect. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Columbus gets a hold of it. With some open space at center. New York's ready to go on the attack. Clutterbuck's going to play it against the half wall. Quick pass to Domi. The Blue Jackets have it now. Kukin's got it across the line. The arms up. There's the whistle. And boy, look at the time here for a penalty coming up. Pretty cut and dry trip on that play. Coaches will tell you, be careful with your stick, but you're trying to get the puck. I don't think a lot of times they do it intentionally. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And we've got a two-on-one. And he's ridden off the puck. And he sends it across to Del Cole. Columbus looks to move the puck from their own end. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Dished on over to Bailey. Here's a short pass to Letty. New York's playing it from the side. The Islanders have it from the corner. Here's a chance right out in front, and they can't convert to the play. Here he is, all alone. Still nothing solved as the third period comes to an end. We've got overtime looming. OT should tell us who wins and who loses, and they're ready to get it underway. Puck is dropped on overtime. Let's find out if there's any heroes out there. Slides it across. Bjorkstrand's hauled down. Penalty on the way. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. The Islanders are getting two minutes for tripping. Trying to get into position to get to the puck. He takes out the player's feet. And off to the box he'll go. Fearless. Totally fearless on the block. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. And now it's grabbed by Komarov. 
Puck picked up by Wierenski. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Sends it across. And he denied that opportunity. Looking to break out here on the power play. Puck scooped up by Bjorkstrand. Could be the game to his teammate. Denies him. Oh, I thought that was over. Yeah, so did a lot of people, not the goalie. Wow. He's the guy that counted, too. What a stop. And that's intercepted. Moved in front. He scores! There it is! OT winner! Columbus looked like they were on their heels, but they deliver big time in overtime. Sometimes you have to reach deep. They were able to do it, and they find the game winner even when it looked like they were scrambling around a little bit. And that'll do it for Ray Pearl. I'm James Sabalski. Thank you.